cool. Getting ready for stage three of season seven. Kind of stretching out his arms. This is what we got to do. So he has to start there, go across those bars, across the monkey bars, across these bars, and get to there without touching the mulch. Then he has to go all the way over here and start right there and go up and then down and then go from there to there all the way around and then go across there and get to that bar and then go across here and then get to that blue pole without touching the mulch and then after they do the blue pole they'll just drop come over here and climb the uh, pole and hit the buzzer at the top up there there's no time limit so here he goes beep 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 he's going across the bar and does his little move and he makes it now he's on to the monkey bars, which he is beast at this, because we do it pretty much every day at school. You know, it's summer break right now. And he just gets across it any way possible. Oh, and he's doing his little move down to the bar. He's got to get across there. Making it to the other bar, and he just has to get to the ladder. And he makes it there. So he just comes down. And comes over here to the start of our probably hardest course out of uh, this, this stage three. Uh, we usually do this a lot on the playground, so we'll see how he does. It looks like he's using his little arms, or not little arms, big arms. But, and he has to find a way to get up on that and transition all the way over to here. And this is probably, if not most difficult stage three course, probably, probably most fun. Can you make the transition without touching the mulch? And he has it. <laughs> and then you just gotta go up here. And come around here. This gray part, he doesn't ne ne have to necessarily cliffhanger across. He can, he can either cliffhanger across, go on top of it, go across, do whatever he wants. But as long as he can get to the other side without touching the mulch. Yep. Is he going on the big ledge or the little ledge? Looks like he's choosing to go on the big. Moving at a pretty quick pace. Sorry if the sun's in your way. He's got to make it to the end and somehow get to the bar. Yeah, there's a tiny spider web up there. But... <laughs> it's cool. After all of these ninja obstacles, we just do really cool tricks. Now, how will we get up here? And then you just got to get to the blue pole. Barely. Almost fail. I try to combine the word fail and follow. He doesn't have to hit up there. He just has to get to it. Or he can hit it if he wants to, but he doesn't have to. It's not necessarily the buzzer, but it's kind of the complete. And then he's got to go and climb this pole. But if I turn it, my tablet sideways, it'll like ruin the whole video, so... And there's no time limit, but... Oh, he's doing a little backflip to get himself warmed up. <laughs> Getting some mulch on his hands, which kind of helps, I guess, but dries him. Here he goes. He's climbing up the pole. They just got to go hit the buzzer up there. Not moving very fast, but... He doesn't have to go fast, he can go at whatever speed he wants. And he's just got to hit the buzzer up there. And he moves on to stage four. So, here he comes down. This part will probably be edited. But, I don't know. And he's got to come talk to Christine Leahy. What's his name? Llamas are cool. 
And here goes Llamas Are Cool. Got on to Christine Leahy to talk about the run. Llamas Are Cool, you had a great run today. You started out fast. I saw you got a little tired towards the end. What, what made you keep going? Well, I think it's because of, I mean, the only thing I had left over was Will, so I had to will myself to keep going and finish the course. Oh, very good. Now, I saw you did a little move here at the end with, with some mulch. What, what is that? Well, when you get the mulch between your hands, wood absorbs water, so if you put it between your hands, it'll absorb the sweat on your hands to dry your hands. Hear that, ninjas? That's a good tip from Mama Dark Cool. All right, we'll see you in the next round. Good job. Woo, stage four. Here's J.W. Robert. On stage three, how fast will he go? Boop, 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 boop. I started filming late. Sorry for the camera glitches, but, uh, just continue. It looks like there's a bunch of pancakes on top of the monkey bars when you grab. It's weird. Exactly, but now we're gonna get a ninja view from the ninja. Here comes the crazy trunk. Just What's he gonna do? Is he gonna surprise us? shaking me. I don't like it because I'm on a thin platform. Now there's J.W. Roberts. Give the camera a high five. Now this is the... Good enough. Wait, what? Good enough for yeah. a camera high five. I thought you were like, you were down there quick. Now this is the fun way to go down. I'm fine with that. Unless his foot did touch the ground. Dun, dun, dun. He's laughing. It probably did. Should we take him out? I have no idea. Uh oh, I left my water in the car. Can you make the transition? Yes. No, yes, no, yes, yes, yeah. He's done it. He's about to beat the stage three, but all he has to do is get across that and go climb the pole that I don't know if you can see. All right, he made it through. Now all he has to do is climb the pole that now I'm sure you can see. You can climb either one. The one, the one on the far side is shorter. Yep. Backflip. Mulch dry. Oh, so you're not going to mulch dry? Cool. Yeah. Feel the pole now. Did it help? Completed stage three as the crowd roars in excitement. It's a new record of one audience member.
Wizard Cole is about to attempt stage four, just to give you a look at what it is. You climb the pole and get to that top bar, but it's not just like in stage three, because you probably think that's just pretty easy since you already did it. You have to go up the pole, get to that bar, only using your hands, no legs, and there's a time limit of 20 seconds. So is you ready? Long as your cool is going in 3, 2, 1, go. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14. Well, he had 14 seconds left, so pretty good. He could have done it in 10. So, he, here he goes over to Christine Leahy. Good job. Good job, Long as our cool, but I didn't see you do your trick with the wood this time. You didn't need it? My hands had stopped sweating because the rest between courses. I see. So I just left it all on the course. Got it. Well, you had a great run there. Good, good time. 14 seconds. So good work. J.W. Roberts, stage four. Beep, 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 beep. Two, three, four, five, six, seven.